Welcome to this video where um, quite interesting project, simple one but interesting one. So my uh, stepson is a English graduate and he asked me was there a method of combining two text files together and um, I kind of thought well can't you copy and paste them together. So we got chatting about uh, his requirements and uh, turns out that what he wanted to be able to do was take two separate poems in two different text files and combine them randomly so that you ended up with a new poem. And uh, I thought well Python's probably good for this so I developed and wrote a quick program. Uh, I'll show you how it works and then I'll uh, walk you through the steps in case you want to try it yourself. So in this folder I have two poems. The first poem is the classic Eats Cloths of Heaven and the second poem is the famous and popular Dylan Rage Against the Dying Lights. Okay so two very different poems um, stored in two separate files and we'll run the program first so you can see what happens. So enter the name of the file. I'm going to call this new poem. Press enter. The merge content of the two files will be in a will be in new poem. The content is merged successfully. And if I go back to the folder you can see there it is, new poem open it up and here you can see it's combined the two um, lines okay so let's keep that one there and let's run it again and this time I'm going to call it bread press enter and I want to go to the folder there's the bread open it up and let's just have a look at these two right definitely different so the idea um, as he explained to me was that he wanted to take two three four five different poems and um, get the program to randomly strip out words or lines from the poems and then see how long it took to actually create you know, a workable or, or, or usable poem. So let's have a look at how this works. Uh, I'm just going to change, there was a little error here. Enter the name of the new file. The merged content of the two files will be in a Oh, we'll be in the yeah, okay, right. That makes sense. Okay, so let's have a quick look. Um, first of all, we have to open up the two poem files. So this is like going and opening them up here. Okay, so it opens up poem one and then it appends all the lines of code here. So all the lines of the poem into a um, list which is called P1 and then we do the same for P2 okay so P2 is poem 2 P1 is poem number 1 basically it finds each of the lines strips them down adds them to uh, a new list called P1 and a new list called P2 we then assign these to the um, other variables, first file, second file, this is just because that's how I wrote the program here. This bit I wrote first, um, so I could uh, switch that up and improve it. And then we combine both of these files together here by appending the first file to the second one. So now all of these lines of code appear in one list. And then we randomly shuffle the list and here is our section where we are asking for you to enter your file name before opening a new file and writing each of the lines um, 
to that file and obviously we end up with our new poem line. Now what's quite interesting is if you add in spaces and the poem now reads the spaces. So if I run this again I'm call this one toast Okay, toast, and uh, there we go. <laughs> so now what I get is the randomness of the lines. Okay, now some of them are included, some of them aren't, because obviously it's a random shuffle. Uh, but you can see this begins to make a very different poem. And um, I think as I mentioned already, what the idea might be is to take each of the words, or two or three of the words at a time, and combine them into a completely new poem. Uh, but we'll see what happens. I mean, the this is version number one. Um, I'm sure it will be updated and develop. And uh, if you check back, don't forget to subscribe uh, and you'll get an update when the next um, iteration of this poem um, has appeared. So if you want to try the program, um, don't forget to have a look on the GitHub, the link's below. Um, or if you want to send me a poem or, or song lyrics that you want to try, um, and you can do it the same, same way. Uh, it'd be quite good actually with two songs, wouldn't it? Or you know, you could take like a, a musical song, such as um, something from Les Mis, and you can combine it with a, a pop song by, say, Justin Bieber, and create a new genre of music. Okay, thank you for watching, and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe.